everyone in this video i will try to solve still uh, from part one aju 2019 uh, still in part one but this is question two yeah in this question two we talk about probability there is a dice x uh, like as, as usual dice there is number one two five and six but here the information here the probability one to five is the same but the probability of six twice yeah okay let's continue for the first part p is the probability p1 up to five yeah and then so the probability of six should be twice twice means the value of l become 2 yeah, so the probability 1 is p Pro probability 6 is 2p twice yeah and since the probability of the whole event is 1 right the total probability is always 1 so we have p1 plus p2 plus p3 plus p4 plus p5 plus p6 equal to 1 yeah this is p p p p this is another p and this is 2p right okay so all together here becomes 7p equal 1 then we got p equal 1 7 okay this is 1 7 okay let's continue so we have the all the probability yeah number two this x is rolled twice in succession yeah okay uh, let us denote a a is event for both rolls oh now comes up p1 up to p4 uh, p5 yeah and b six comes at this one okay so actually uh, if the dice x roll twice here the possibility is become if a we can see here so probability one to five is here right is here five p or five times one seven it means five over seven okay so this is five over seven and the probability of six become the rest two over seven so in here we can see a is the even both one to five yeah so this one for the first row and the second row the same yeah so the probability of a it means probability become 25 per 49 yeah here 25 here 49 yeah and let's check the b b number six come at least once yeah six come at least one so we can count the probability like one negative probability a why because in a we already count here is there is no six comes up okay all is one to five yeah so if we one minus this one it should be we got the probability b at least six comes once yeah because in b it's possible six uh, appear in the first row and this is non six first second or non six in the first row and six comes up in this in the second row or six occur in both yeah actually this is for b actually this is for b yeah but rather than we count its probability better we count there is no six and no six 
in the first row and second row and actually this is a right this is a so if we want to find this better for us just calculate one negative this one okay it will be give you the same answer yeah okay so the result here is 24 over 49 yeah this is 24 this is 49 okay so let's continue we see that here x for x choose the correct answer from this option yeah okay you can see here how they want to compare a and b yeah? a 25 over 49 b 24 over 49 so this is a is greater 25 is greater than 24 right so a is greater this one or this one okay and let's find the rest the difference the difference okay so let's continue find the difference ba minus bb is 25 over 49 is 24 over 49 1 over 49 1 over 49 is less than this one so which option is correct not less than less than this one yeah a greater than b the difference less than this one so choose this for this okay four next here the last part in the second question in part one now they want to roll three times in previous problem two times and now here three times C is the event all three rolls comes up one to five. Oh, okay like before yeah so if we want to count probability of C you just three times yeah the first second and third yeah the first probability that comes one to five is five over seven for second exactly the same and the third roll exactly the same so from here we got 125 over 343 okay this is the probability of C and let's continue to the probability of B ah, almost similar eh? D is the number 6 come at least one yeah so like before actually if you want to count one by one first second and third uh, roll the probability the possibility so I mean the possibility number six come at least one is can be here here appear here here or here so this is non six non six or maybe better I write like this non six non six non six non six non six non six if this is six appear only at uh, exactly one yeah if two can be like this or can be like this or can be like this this is exactly two or if all in all rolls all six like this you can count one by one this possibility yeah but the fastest way is you just count there is no six in the all three roll and actually this is is this one yeah you just count like probability d one minus this one yeah so if you want to count all of this probability you just find the other who do not need require like here and you just one negative this probability yeah okay so in here we got 200 sorry 218 over 343 
okay and still again they want to compare yeah PC and PD yeah PC and PD okay and from here we see D is greater yeah we see here D is greater than C so this is correct this is correct this is not correct C is greater not correct C is greater not correct yeah so we just choose from the uh, uh, the top two option okay and they they want also to compare okay twice PC so if twice times probability of C we got 250 over 343 right and they compare PD less than or not less than twice if you compare this the twice of PC is greater than PD right so PD is not less than uh, PD is less than twice yeah PD is less than twice okay so choose this one for Y okay should be one thank you and see you in the next video